Okay. Rolling, Ooh. rolling on the river. What's up, guys? Today I'm here with Kay West. Miss West, how long have you been working in the district? I have been in the district for 47 years continuously, and prior to that, I substituted for two years, so that makes a total of 49. Now in that 49 years, I'm sure you've seen a lot of like administration come and go. How many principals do you think you've seen come and go? Mm. Oh my goodness. A lot. Um, probably 12. That is, uh, that's a few principals. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Now, I had you for my freshman English class. Have you always taught English? No. Um, I actually started out teaching 7th and 8th grade math. And from there, uh, I took a few years off when I had my daughter. And when I came back, I taught 2nd grade down at Gerald. And I wanted to come back to the then junior high school and that's when I started teaching English. And I've been teaching English ever since. Well, you would always make us sing uh, my favorite things by the sound of music. Absolutely. You gave me a bad score on one of my tests, though, I remember that. Well, it, why did I do that? Uh, that, was, that was my fault, but. <laughs> <laughs> Usually I give you what you earned. You know, if, if you did well, you got a good score, and if you didn't do well, hmm, let the chips fall where they may. I think it was a chapter 20 quiz on how to kill a mockingbird, or no, to kill a mockingbird. To kill a mockingbird. To kill a mockingbird. Yes. I'm in scholar, okay. I should know that. <laughs> you having a good day, Miss West? I am having a good day. Um, when I gave up halftime teaching, in 2019 when the pandemic hit then i came back in the fall as a substitute and you know what i'm really enjoying it um, i get to be with a variety of teachers i substitute uh, for mr airing quite a bit and um, if any english teacher needs to be off i substitute for them and today i am mr bowman the wrestling coach and I'm teaching history. I love it. Can you wrestle, Miss Miss West? No, I don't think I can. I can't. I can't help out in that area. I'm. That's not my coaching strength. Well, is there anything else you'd like to say? Anything else? Well, I am known for my saying. Failing to prepare is preparing to fail. That has been with me all of these years. Uh, when I was at Walmart yesterday afternoon after school, one of my former students yelled across the store to me, failing to prepare is preparing to fail, Mrs. West. And so that made me feel pretty good that if I've taught nothing else to my students and if they follow that word of advice, they'll be okay in this world. Well, I really appreciate you coming out today, Miss West. You're very welcome. Glad to be here.